Welcome to Insider Medicine In-Depth. I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Combining the two blood pressure lowering drugs, benazapril and amlodipine, protects the kidneys better than combining benazapril with the diuretic hydrochlorothiazide, according to research published online ahead of print in The Lancet. Here's some information about high blood pressure and kidney disease. Having untreated high blood pressure makes the heart work harder, which can over time damage blood vessels all over the body. One of the places blood vessels are often damaged in those with high blood pressure is the kidney. High blood pressure is a leading cause of kidney disease. Researchers from the University of Chicago representing the accomplished study investigators randomly assigned over 11,000 patients from five countries who were suffering from high blood pressure to treatment with the gold standard of benazapril combined with hydrochlorothiazide, a drug that helps flush excess fluid from the body, or with a novel combination of benazapril plus amlodipine, a drug that uses a different mechanism to lower blood pressure. All the participants were considered to be at high risk for cardiovascular disease. The study was stopped early after an average follow-up period of about three years because those in the benazapril hydrochlorothiazide group were nearly twice as likely to experience progression of chronic kidney disease as those in the benazapril amlodipine group. The rate of progression of chronic kidney disease was 2% in the benazapril amlodipine group versus nearly 4% in the benazapril hydrochlorothiazide group. Today's research suggests that healthcare professionals may make a change from preferentially prescribing benazapril and hydrochlorothiazide for high blood pressure to benazapril and amlodipine because this second combination does a better job of protecting the kidneys. For Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.